I'm Pastor Vincent Agoya from Kenya. I live in the city of Nairobi. Exposing Saturn's end time strategies for me was a timely course. As a minister uh, of the gospel, I found the most recent and well researched and reliable information on this subject. Indeed, the class notes and the prayers that were shared out weekly made it easy and resourceful for me to read over again and even to do further research on the subject. The knowledge that I gained is vital to my work as a deliverance minister, processing, generating new battle strategies to overcome the enemy for myself and even for the people that I serve uh, in, um, in the church. It, it, is, it was like getting forearmed and for, for, for warned with, uh, with the knowledge, the equipping and the tools uh, as the Bible tells us that the time is short for Satan and is attacking the world with great fury. So for me in a nutshell, the school has increased my spiritual awareness. As a teaching in spiritual warfare, my awareness of the realities that are around me and even the importance of my faith in Jesus Christ increased through attendance in this school. As with my experience from other schools, I have also increased my ability to resist the devil in confidence, uh, as well as in the confidence of setting others free. That is a, a sense of empowerment that has come through my attendance in the school. The school helped me in shifting my worldview on different subjects that earlier had been just commonplace or, uh, or events that seemed innocent but had deep um, meaning or deep roots in spiritual dimensions that are opposed uh, to our knowledge and understanding, understanding of our faith in Jesus Christ. So the impact it had on me is that I had a re-evaluation of all things, including our own traditional African uh, practices, uh, which I may have participated in directly or indirectly uh, or before I was born again, and even in my childhood, considering the spiritual impact it will have in my life and on my faith. Now that I have the knowledge of the Lord, the saving grace of the Lord. There was a personal transformation. The school helped me uh, to be more intentional now, to be more aware even of the importance of repentance. Um, Against such things as I've mentioned, uh, ancestral worship, things rooted in in deep, deep in, 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 in deep in rooted in deep uh, spiritual uh, covenants. Uh, the school helped me at a personal level to repent, eh, to lead my family through deep repentance as well as. Uh, 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 an increasing awareness on the collateral effect that uh, such things may have. Um, uh, such simple things as maybe just glossing through a horoscope in a newspaper a page uh, or dabbing into um, occult. Um, it had an overall effect of releasing me from a deeper guilt uh, after realizing how deeply we are connected uh, to these things concerning our my, concerning my personal background um, my personal African background I also found the school to be meaningful in the uh, in the area of transformative transformation as each, each session left me with a renewed sense sense of awareness 
a discernment, critical reflection. And I thank God for the opportunity to have participated to the end um, of this uh, school through the Wholeness Haven Academy. And yes, I will recommend the school to everyone who wants to follow the Lord and to serve Him. Um, as in the days of Noah, uh, we are here to see more demonic manifestations and activities are coming to the face of the earth and especially being concealed as techno uh, te technological advancement. Um, my message to the church is that let us seek the face of the Lord while it could still be found. Um, they, they are coming up with new advanced technologies to fulfill their plans to control the world. Where does this leave us as believers? And many we know will be deceived to follow, uh, to follow uh, doctrines uh, that are uh, seeking to, uh, to, 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 to propagate or to misalign the truth that we know. The world indeed is being prepared for the end time and uh, the enemy is working double shift. So my call to the church is that we wake up to this reality and uh, let us seek the face of the Lord in spirit and in truth while he may still be found.